This is uh, bruised up for, for, from her being long. Uh huh. So. Ooh, is that what that is? Yeah. Oh. Oh, 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 oh. Just sit down, just sit down. You'll be all right. She can't bear weight, weight too much because it's painful, so I'm going to put it to the front and do the front. Help her relax. Okay, this is going to be a little bit more comfortable for her. We got quite a bit to take off. Now I use my knee to stop it. See it right here coming out. Look. Oh! <laughs> 
Now I'm going to take it, go to the back. I'll have to rest. Yeah. So now we're going to go and do the hinds. But as you can see, I still got quite a bit to go. See, this is the old axis. Oh, 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 oh. down and finish her up in the front. <laughs> She's trying to take that rope off. <laughs> but I put the rope on there so she wanna uh, kick forward and uh, go underneath the uh, the stock. Well, I'm gonna continue with the hinds, and like I said, please keep your back comments to yourself. This is about helping the horses. Uh, your back comments are not needed here. If you say you have a better idea, then show me. Don't just tell me. Uh, I'm just trying to show you how I do it. That necessarily means that you have to do it, but I've been doing it for uh, over 20 years, and it's been working out Went great. A lot of people have been using it, so uh, I just want to thank you all for caring, sharing, enjoying, learning most of all. Well, have a great day, everyone. I'm going to continue with the hinds, finish them up, and I'll show you the pictures. Great day.